Fruit Farm is really a story about a father and a son uh, and all the insanity that goes on with a father-son relationship, especially working in a family business and even more importantly, working on a family farm. Let's take our pants off. There's uh, Joe's Scottish mother that goes to church every day. There's uh, the relationship he has with his sisters that don't have to work every day with their dad on the farm. And then everyone he works at the farm with, people from Jamaica, from Thailand, from Vietnam, from Mexico, uh, multiculturalism that's honest and raw and real and funny. Niagara Lake is actually called the prettiest town in Canada. Um, a little pretentious maybe. We have a Lord Mayor. We don't have a mayor, we have a Lord Mayor. We sort of scratch the surface and pull the curtain up and let you know what happens behind the scenes. I grew up in Niagara Lake. This town means the world to me. I've tried to give as much back as the town's given me. Uh, the testing ground for this whole premise has really been my stand-up act and uh, I've never actually charged to do stand-up comedy. I've, uh, in fact, donated hundreds and thousands of dollars to causes that we feel are worthwhile in this town. Uh, we've, we've done it in downtown Toronto, we've done it in New York, we've done it in Pennsylvania, done it in Ohio, and of course all over Niagara. Johnny, we get a bottle of Killex, a bottle of Xanthanax, and a bottle of Rodecha. We know this material works, and it's, it's a real chance to, to enhance the connection I have with this town and, uh, and show off the funny side of Niagara the Lake. The people of this town uh, deserve this. They would work as hard as anyone to make sure that whatever we put uh, on the screen would be a success.